Hi, I'm Charlie, head chef of the Ox Barn and Thyme. We are making a soda bread today. It's very quick and easy. Um, it's not laborious. It's got none of the yeast, none of the proving, none of the kneading that's required with other doughs. Um, its raising agent is baking soda and it's a great loaf for beginners to start with. So, to start with, we've got 400 grams of wholemeal flour and 75 grams of white baker's flour. Uh, you can add into this sunflower seeds, pumpkin seeds to give it a little bit of crunch as well, but we're staying quite basic. We've also got baking soda, uh, fine table salt, black treacle, an egg, and most importantly, sour milk, because this bread was made in a time when there's no refrigeration, and it was a good way to use up soured milk. Uh, finally, what goes into it as well is just a tablespoon of rapeseed oil too. So, to start with, we are going to add uh, all the dry ingredients in together, which is the flours, a teaspoon of the bicarb, which you just put through a sieve, and a teaspoon of your table salt for seasoning. Now you're wet. That's the 425 ml of sour milk. It's a good idea just to reserve a little bit of it back, um, just in case the bread is too wet. Your egg, your teaspoon of treacle, which you want to be nice and generous with. Get it all in. And finally, your tablespoon of olive oil, or rapeseed oil rather. Make sure all your ingredients are incorporated together. Once this is done, you can make a well in the center of your dry and tip in your wet. So make a claw with your hand and just start to bring the ingredients together. Getting right to the bottom, incorporating all the flour. If it's a little bit too dry, you can add your little bit of reserved milk to make sure it's the right consistency, but this is looking pretty good. So this bread needs minimal kneading, so it's ready now to go in the oven. So, um, Holly, can you just pass me that tray, please? Thank you. And this goes on. It is a rough bread. Get as much dough off the fingers as you can. And don't leave any in the bowl. And so now all we do is score the bread nice and deep according to folklore to let the fairies out. So now your bread is scored, it's ready to go in the oven at 200 degrees for an hour. Okay, so we've left our bread for about 40 minutes in the oven. I'm just gonna take it out and have a little look at it. And it's looking pretty nice and brown and crusty, which is what we want. And I don't know if you can hear that, but that's the sort of sound you're looking for. So, I'm just gonna leave it to sit to one side, just to cool down a little bit, and then we can eat it. So it'll last a day, but after that, it's probably best for toast. Soda bread does make the best toast. And we can give it a try if anyone would like some. Mm, yes, please. Please. Looks good. Mm. Mm. 
here. Delicious. Mmm. Very good. Mm -hmm. Very good. That is good. That's good, Charlie. Well done. Thank you very much. Delicious. Mm. And Three. cuts.